Yo, 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 what's up, people? It's your boy. I'm Chris the Don One, and I am back with another video. Yes, sir. Now, we're going to be talking about why Skip Bayless have so much hate for Terrell Owens. And it's really simple, all right? But before we get into today's topic, I first like to say this for the record. Terrell Owens do deserve blame for the situation that he is in now, all right? But Skip Bayless, you deserve some of this blame as well. So y'all deserve, y'all got to even this up and divvy this out half and half, all right? The reason why Skip Bayless have so much hate for Terrell Owens because Skip Bayless is a longtime friend to Steve Mariucci. And Steve Mariucci supported Jeff Garcia. Terrell Owens did not like Jeff Garcia. He didn't like him as a quarterback. They never met eye to eye. And he clearly had issues with Steve Mariucci, all right? And Skip Bayless hated that notion, all right? Skip Bayless felt like that team could have went to not only deep into the playoffs, but win a Super Bowl, and he blames Terrell Owens for that. So when the 49ers got rid of Terrell Owens, well, not got rid of him. Well, yeah, you could say they got rid of him because they never re-signed him. <laughs> uh, Terrell Owens started looking around what, what was his next team. Now, he wanted to play for the Ravens. That deal didn't go through. He ultimately landed with the Philadelphia Eagles, all right? And everything was cold, steady, but... Terrell Owens and Donovan McNabb, they didn't meet eye to eye on the playoff issue when it came to offensive plays, and they had issues with one another. Now, Terrell Owens, if you hear from Terrell Owens, Terrell Owens is pretty much saying Donovan McNabb is a company guy, all right? He ain't for the brothers, all right? Now, that's what Terrell Owens is saying, and not only Terrell Owens, but a lot of other players. So, a lot of players, especially with the Philadelphia camp, was supporting Terrell Owens. And Donald McNabb was seeing this, okay? He was feeling the pressure. He was feeling the motherfucking heat, all right? So, when uh, when the playoffs, uh, that playoff year where they ultimately went to the Super Bowl and Terrell Owens injured himself, Donovan McNabb was saying in the corner, yo, I'm going to have to, while Terrell Owens is out, I'm going to have to show the company that, yo, we can do this without Terrell Owens. Now, they began a win streak, especially in the playoffs, and when they got to the Super Bowl, Terrell Owens was active to play in the Super Bowl, all right? And Donovan McNabb, from reports, was not up to his standards when you're talking about the Super Bowl. A lot of people said that he flanked out, he passed out, he threw up on the field. He he didn't have his shit together, all right? And Terrell Owens, not only he felt like Donovan McNabb was a company man, but also Donovan McNabb never supported anyone when it came to renegotiating their contracts. Now, Donald McNabb did support it. Uh, uh, I forgot the uh, running back for the Philadelphia Eagles. He supported and campaigned for him to get his fucking deal. But when it came for when it came time for T.O. to get re up, Donald McNabb wasn't even there. So that even drew even a further wedge between the relationship between Donald McNabb and Terrell Owens. All right. So now we're talking about the Cowboys. Everyone and their grandmama know that Skip Bayless is a huge fucking Cowboy fan, all right? Who could blame him? I'm a Cowboy fan, you know, all right? So even God's a Cowboy fan. <laughs> so um, when um, T.O. went to the Cowboys, Bill Parcells was the coach. Bill Parcell was not co-signing to the fact that Jerry Jones wanted Terrell Owens on the team. All right. Bill Parcell felt like they should have been 
looking at other people. But no, no, Jerry Jones is the owner. All right. So whatever Jerry Jones wants, Jerry Jones is going to get. So ultimately, T.O. landed with the Cowboys. All right. Uh, they had some great seasons there. And there was friction once again between Terrell Owens and Bill Parcells. Bill Parcells is an old school guy, all right? Bill Parcells cut from the same tree like, like these other coaches. And Skip Bayless is a part of that tree, all right? Now, Skip Bayless is not friends with Bill Parcells. He's, he's nowhere near his friend. But when you're talking about coaches... Skip Bayless speaks highly about Bill Parcells, all right? And especially uh, uh, Andy Reid, all right? And that's why there's beef between the two individuals. So, so much so that Skip Bayless, week after week after week, month after month after month, year after year after year, was on this negative campaign to discredit everything um, Terrell Owens did on the field, all right? And this campaign was so much successful that a lot of writers who was already on the fence when you're talking about voting Terrell Owens in, they left him off the ballot. And they put Marvin Harrison on the ballot, and he's a Hall of Famer. Marvin Harrison is... In the Hall of Fame, but T.O. is not. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, Mar Marvin Harrison was involved in a murder, uh, in a, involved in a murder, a crime, okay? Now, he wasn't the one that pulled the trigger, but if you read the report, they're pretty much saying the gun that was used to the murder was owned by Marvin Harrison. Now, you would think something like that would keep a person, you know, back maybe one or two years uh, from not being in the Hall of Fame. But apparently these writers didn't give two fucks about it because they felt like, yo, we rather have anyone else in the Hall of Fame besides Terrell Owens. And that's because of the negative campaign that was unleashed and it was created and formed by Skip Bayless. And that's why Skip Bayless really don't like Terrell Owens, okay? He don't mind, you know, interviewing Terrell Owens. I'm pretty sure Terrell Owens is going to be on Undisputed uh, sometime later on in the future. And they're going to bring this subject up again. If I was Terrell Owens and if I was a representative for Terrell Owens, I would stay away from Undisputed. I would stay away from Skip Bayless, okay? Because you're trying to get in the Hall of Fame, okay? Why I go back on a show again that's going to be pro-Skip Bayless and... That's what they're going to, uh, you know, that's what they're going to use to drive ratings. Skip Bayless is going to call you Team Obliterator, all right? And he's going to point out all these stories. Why well, go through all that shit again for those writers to, you know, a year later, have that even X'd into their memory, all right? But guys, tell me what the fuck you think out there. Rate, comment, subscribe. It's your motherfucking boy. I'm Chris the Don One, and I'm out.